And here in the Bay Area, well, we saw our fair share of rain from the exact same system. I mean, close to two inches near San Francisco. We passed two inches of rain near Novato and near Vallejo. We got just around an inch. Now I'm going to drop this and show you what it's looking like for us as we head into the forecast today because we still see some light, light lingering showers kind of building in from offshore, mostly up in the North Bay. And that'll continue to be the trend as we head into the next couple days. But let's head over to the Sierra because, yeah, that snow is starting to die down. But as we head into the next couple days, Donner, for example, could still see close to around eight inches accumulating from today until Wednesday as a winter storm warning is in effect there. Now, just south of Donner is Palisades and Palisades made its mark this weekend. 171 mile per hour winds were recorded just at the peak of that mountain ridge as we went into our weekend forecast and back here in the bay we had some gusty conditions too i mean not 170 mile per hour winds but it was worth noting that we were under a wind advisory heading into the weekend and now it's starting to look a lot better winds today anywhere up to around 15 miles per hour it's really not that bad match that with some light showers kind of trickling in and out throughout the forecast today it's going to be about a hundredth of an inch of rain accumulating down near san jose up into fairfield throughout the afternoon today heading into our forecast tomorrow by wednesday we get a quick splash of showers kind of building in from offshore in those morning hours and then it'll start clearing up nice throughout our Thursday and Friday forecast. So that's the whole week in total. I mean, starting off a little bit unsettled, getting better day by day. And as I show you what's happening for us today, our daytime highs are actually a lot cooler after that cold front really swept its way throughout the Bay Area and all throughout Northern California for that matter. Today we're talking about 50s, anywhere from Antioch over into Redwood City, upper 50s near Fremont in Livermore with low 60s down near San Jose, where last week, just around Wednesday, we were talking about 70s. So a big change in the forecast throughout the past seven days, and we'll continue to see a gradual warm up actually as we head into this week with upper 60s as early as Friday and sunshine in the forecast too. Oh gosh, it's going to be beautiful as we kick off the weekend and then it ends really fast as we head into Saturday because rain returns into the Bay Area and temperatures drop right back down to the low 60s. So that's our week in total. Mild conditions to kick off the week. A lot of unsettled weather until Wednesday. Thursday is that dry break that we need. And Friday, it's going to be a gorgeous one.